Oh my god, this BMW is so slow. Man, the tint job on this guy's rear window is terrible. Really terrible. You know one thing I haven't seen is people been putting tint in their front windscreen. I don't get it. But that's something that I'm seeing quite quite often. It seems like car stuff comes in like trends. There was a while ago there was guys putting like big balls in the back of their cars. I don't know if you remember that. It was the big ball scare of 2004. They were just hanging balls like these rubber balls from the back of their hitches of cars. And then at a certain point people started putting those spinner wheels. Who are these people that ride motorcycles and they have masks on? I swear to God, I see these guys often. And one of the guys that sold me this scooter, he also has a scooter, and I just like was shaking at his head, uh, shaking at him, shaking my head at him because he had t-shirts, shorts, um, sandals, and a mask, and then a half helmet. Okay, this guy could really like move over a bit. I don't understand why he just doesn't move over. Alright, where are you going, bus? You know, that's one thing I notice is the SUV riders that like on speed bumps and a little bit of a tiny pothole, they basically come to a screeching halt. It's like, what the hell did you buy an SUV for? The Fairfax finally took down their plywood. See, everything is returning back to normal. No more plywood. Crazy Golf Club. The Crazy Golf Club. Swingers. What a terrible name for a golf club. It is freezing. How the hell did it get to be so cold? This guy in the tent must be cold. Oh, oh my god, another freaking tent just popped up. Look at that. Another tent. From week to week, there's more tents popping up. I like the look of people inside restaurants eating. You know, especially like fancy restaurants. I just hang out outside looking in. At Versys. That's a nice bike. You know, you don't hear a lot about the Kawasaki Versus 300 or even the normal one, which is the, what, the six, 650? Yeah, it's like a car that, or a bike that you just don't hear too much about. One of the job requirements that a news reporter has is to look artificial. Do you ever like look at TV news reporters, women? and go like wow that's an authentic person i've never done that i mean even judging from the hair the hair looks like it's wearing them have you ever noticed that it looks like a helmet you gotta watch out for pedestrians like going in but you do have to admire this um, this little bike's uh, ability of kind of just going in and out. It just saves me so much time. I really wish I had my own stalker. You know, people are good looking when they have stalkers. You know, a stalker that's basically a nice stalker is just a friend. I had this conversation with a, um, a co-worker today. She's like, oh, I got a stalker. And I think she was just concerned, but I was just very, very jealous. At a certain point, stalking used to be something that women would be flattered. I mean, I would be flattered if I had like a, a stalker. I don't think that movie Blazing Saddles could have been made today. Especially with the woke culture. Jesus, can you imagine a lot of these movies that were made back in the day? Do you, have you watched the movie Blazing Saddles? The things they say, you know, there's a lot of N-words flying around, but 
you know my favorite scene is when they're like um, hiring henchmen and they're in the lineup and the guy is in the desk and he's writing down the qualifications of these henchmen and one of the henchmen comes over and he's like he's like qualifications and he's like murder rape pillaging rape and the guy corrects him you said rape twice and then the other guy goes I really like rape <laughs> oh man I love that you know when I was dating this woke girl I showed her that scene she was not as amused all right let me get through here I don't like to go through Silver Spring this area but oh shit he's making a right Ugh. man this truck is loaded up look at how look how low he is to the ground that's a lot of cement that's a whole pallet of cement that's kind of incredible that's like 80 pounds per bag yeah, that's some big cementing look at that look how low it is and that's a full-size truck too that's a real man there doing what pickup trucks were meant to do not one of those lifestyle trucks you know those guys that they get the Ford 150 and they use it like a Camry one of my favorite comedians is Bill Cosby but I don't really like his comedy though qualifications rape murder awesome and rape you said rape twice I like rape 